victim in the Burger King explosion is crying out for help. She get born up, you know. Born up like when you're born to Carmel and rice, born up in a pot bottom. The girl is crying out for help right now. Burger King pledges assistance for explosion. Victims seeking urgent overseas care. Victims are crying out, ladies and gentlemen. See her up on the screen. One of them that, you know, may I tell her, say, I could have me you in the Burger King facility. Would I get burned up to, you know? A serious thing going on, you know? When I watch the video right now, up, up, up. Ooh, yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Bag they have to make a statement. If I know bag of things, TV, it don't make sense. A bag of things, TV, I run things all the time. Bag of things, they have to make a statement. If I know bag of things, TV, it don't make sense. A bag of things, TV, I run things all the time. Bag of things, yeah, man, TV, of things media TV, media. the world's greatest. The family of supervisor who was injured in an explosion at the Burger King outlet in New Kingston on Wednesday is seeking urgent medical care for her overseas. She need to be taken overseas quick, 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 quick before she die. Fewers are sub. She's in serious condition right now. May I tell a man, them need to rush her overseas quick. But she need the money. Burger King. Need to start fuck up some money right now. The amount of money we want to make off of the Jamaican people, them. Saying, we don't need to fuck up the money now. You know what I'm saying? Quotation. She is in a race against time. Her vitals are fluctuating. We are seeking facilities that have modern equipment, accommodation, and burn specialists who will be able to handle the different outcomes so she can get the best care. We have made contact with several hospitals overseas already as well as the Air Ambulance, Rene Focus Johnson, a sister of the injured supervisor, Kerian Focus, told the Jamaica Observer. Oh my God, time is running out. Time is running out on this lady. Viewers and sub, she need help. No, 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 quick and fast. Here we go now. Now that we have medical report, we are trying to take it to the next step. I am absolutely traumatized, but I have to stay strong. Most of my family members are overseas and are unable to be here. I am exhausted. However, I am pushing and on leaning on the Lord for his strength. And I have also have confident that she will push through. And that's just saying. And she's running up and down to help her sister. But she needs some help right now. She needs Burger King to step up the thing. The injured woman's mother, Luna Jackson, said that she was at home in Kingston when she got the call about the explosion and that her daughter was badly burnt. She said she instantly put God on the job and is open for priors that her 46-year-old daughter will be flown to an hospital overseas quickly and that she will survive. Shall no star. We have to pray for that girl right now. Me not lie. Please keep the prayers coming. Pray for her. Seeing? Because right now she needs some help. The overseas facility them have all the technologies. But Jamaica cannot have yet. Seeing? Uncle Sam country have the technologies and the equipment them for save her. Seeing? Now watch this now. Second incident, you know. This girl is missing. Seeing? And on a small take her right now. She has been washed away. By water, some serious water will catch Jamaica over there. Yeah, man, she has been swept away in St. Mary. And they're now resuming the searches for her and some other people will get missing too. Saying, the searches for the two persons who were believed to have been swept away at a river in Gasseltown, Gasseltown, St. Mary, is to resume on Saturday. The missing person have been identified as 19-year-old Chrisan Steel, popular known as Pumpa and Omar Sykers, both from St. Anjo. He was a sub. So these people are, are gone. Water came and swept them away. The Marine Police, the Jamaica Defense Force, JDF, Coast Guard and residents tried to locate Steel and a man on Friday. But they were hampered by the river still being in spate as a result of heavy rains. 
which continue on the day. Rain a come down, rain wash your everything. Water come over and take with the people them. Judge and me I tell them man. I remember you know some people live close to the river you know, the riverbed you know. But when me I say still, you have to avoid building house or going to these areas when it is rainy season. When it is prone to be overflown by water and rain. So when me I say still, what well, precaution has to be met you know. People need to come up with more precaution to take measures to protect themselves and their family. Watch what you must know. The peer were part of a group enjoying recreational activities in the river on Thursday when heavy rains elsewhere in the area caused the water to surge, sweeping the woman away around 3 p.m. Wow, the water just rise up on them, you know. Suddenly, you know, like a thief in the night. And them never they pay attention to, to the whole thing. And she got swept away you now. And the youth now try to save him. And the youth now comes up woman and lose him balance you know, and lose him step. The water take him away. Remember I did a report on that youth, you know, look a young youth, you know. But the water take away and kill you know. See boy, me I tell her he set away. He was trying to save this girl, man. Me I tell him. This is the girl that he was trying to save and lost his own life. In an heroic attempt. The man reported tried to save the woman from the flood water, but he too was washed away by the murky waters. Dangerous thing, you can't hold on for water. In commenting on Friday's effort to locate the pier, head of the St. Mary Police Superintendent Bobette Morgan Simpson said the water's visibility hampered the efforts of the security forces. So they are looking for them, seeing where I think they'll find the boy now. My report that they'll find the youth now. But this girl is missing, you know. The river is still in very muddy, extremely muddy. So it is not like we are able to see anything in the water because the water is muddy. Morgan Simpson told the reporters. She is advising persons to exercise caution as they venture into rivers, especially when it starts to rain. When you're in the water and it's a rain at this time, take what on yourself from the water. Don't stay there. It is dangerous. I don't know tell you. See? Now for the third incident, ladies and gentlemen. Man shot fatally in Mount Salem, St. James. A man gets shot. You know? Shot dead. A man is dead following a shooting incident on Barnett Street in Montego Bay, St. James. Yesterday, all this St. James, man. St. James never take a break. All this killing going on. You are going now. He is 28 year old. Ike Tart Winter, otherwise called Nathaniel, a laborer of Caton Lane, Mount Salem, St. James. Reports said that about 5.05 p.m., Winter was in a motor vehicle when someone allegedly approached him, pulled a gun and opened fire. It's very quick, you know, him in a vehicle, you know. The man approached him, Papa, come sir, Papa, fin gun, and just wet him up. When the police arrived, Winter was seen lying on the ground with multiple gunshot wounds to his upper body. When the police said, come on in there, man, the police said, couldn't save him, boy. Saying, he was assisted to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. The police are still investigating the matter. Yo, something, you know, something, you know. The man just walked up on him with a gun, you know, and opened fire upon the man, you know. Saying, no argument, nothing. Just wet him up completely. You understand what I say? Him dead, man. Him dead on the spot, man. I tell him, man. I'll when they rush him. Sometimes them dead on the spot. Because the amount of gunshot to a boy, then give them. The criminal boy, they shoot them in their head, upper body. They make sure so they're dead. Because most of them gun money are hits, you know. I eat them a carry out. They carry no hit job. You see me, I say. So I saw a thing set right now, viewers and sub. Remember me telling you. Know. So right now still you don't know say a bag of things made that even man. Like, share and subscribe. Up, 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 up. Bag of things media TV, man. Thank you for watching. Make sure you share it. Make sure you subscribe. Press that notification bell to stay updated, man. Jamaican assassin killing all names. Urban legend. Jackal out.